Every eventuality in our lives is an amalgam of strive and destiny. As we continuously leap into the darkness, the trust we repose in the universe is the poetry of life. So much is said, so much is unsaid, but we know the rhythms will lead us where we should be. This is Neil Bhandari and you are listening to Uncut Poetry. Adventure in Two Worlds So much of every day fills me and I feel I am the universe's drain pipe chosen to exhaust its rush of disposables. And I wonder why. I have been good to the world. I have been open to its grace and gorgeousness. I have given permanent residence to the morning dove call. Stopped in my walk till I know how lilies change nature as they fade into the wind and light. I have seen the exact line and color of a leaf as it colors itself into the earth. always the purveyor of the soul and things which gambol crawl bloom burst i kneel to watch the snail pass lay till the lilies curl to make me their own and then i move from the universe's largess into the world's arena i walk into the rut of daily strive from the undemanding nature of mornings metamorphosing into reactions wondering if i am a wish without luck a grimace masquerading as a smile a denizen of two worlds and i ask of myself why am i two people how my definition could be a forked road between the falling light and the neon glare how could my corollaries be rules I tear my clothes out I tear myself out I convert my drain pipes into bridges and walk out naked oblivious to the disbelief knowing finally my world to be what I define knowing finally my world to be what I define We live multiple lives. Each one of us have variations, but every day our paths fork out and we move from the secure to the stormy, from standing naked to being armored, from garnering the blessings of the universe to plowing through the detritus of the denizenry. Often we are able to navigate this transition in the simplest way possible. we remain the same in every world raw and uncluttered ready to take the blows for being us but more often than not we tweak ourselves to the scenarios in front and archetypes expected to fit in to flit through without too much damage to the world or ourselves but it's not always easy definitely not for the sensitive soul which wants to remain true and get by peacefully and i say to such people go gently be true for there is a reward at the end of every struggle to fit in or not to be recognized for being authentic and the universe invariably converges its rewards towards such people albeit slowly dreadfully so I learned to stay in two worlds as two people for a long time and it was extremely strenuous apart from being incontrovertibly inauthentic until I could no longer be what I was not I have no memory of the inflection point the moment when something inside me said I will implore but I dropped pretenses and I lost friends and I got peace I seed lesser commitments I could speak my mind with ease I could say no with complete peace of mind and I walked guiltless 
the drain pipe of my worlds became a bridge and both my worlds converged into one this is sunil bhandari and you are listening to uncut poetry if you enjoyed this poem rate it on spotify or leave a comment on apple podcast and i have a lovely newsletter called the uncuts which is like a sunday dollop of warmth and fun and beauty subscribe to it the link is in the show notes and if you loved this episode please do share it with someone you love see you next week